What took you so long? Can't you do your only job is Daisy's blood bank? Ethan, I can't! Cut the crap! Daisy was in a car accident and she needs blood transfusion. I know you both have our age negative type. Ethan, I can't! Can't what? Congratulations, Mrs. William. You are pregnant. But you need to take care of yourself because your physical condition is not great. Hi, little one. Will your daddy be happy to hear this news? Either way, mommy will protect you. Ethan, I can't give my blood to Daisy now. I am pregnant. Stop pretending to be pathetic. You agreed to be Daisy's blood bank. You said if I marry you, you will always give your blood to Daisy. This is how you make up for the accident three years ago. No, I didn't do it. It was Daisy. You invited Daisy to go mountain climbing. She got into an accident. Now the police found out. You called the hit and run driver the day before. I don't know how it happened. Daisy asked me out and... Save it! If it wasn't for you, Daisy would still be able to have children. How could you do this to her? She's such a nice girl. <laughs> nice. We'll take as much blood as we need. Ethan, I thought I would never see you again. It's alright, I'm here. Amanda has taken a lot of blood for me. You should take her home, Goris. I'm fine. I don't need your concern. Me too. Get out. Of here. She's fine. She's always healthy. But didn't say nothing. What happened? I'm fine. You're fine. You fainted. I bring some milk for you. Daniel Parker. What are you doing in my house? What are you doing here? Do you know Amanda is fainted? What does it have to do with you? Daniel. And will take care of me. You can go. It's okay. Sure. Why are you coming back? You called him here as soon as you got back from the hospital, didn't you? So you went back just for him? No, I didn't. We are just friends. Your body is the only valuable thing you have. No, Ethan. I don't want this now. Stop pretending to be innocent. Your body is screaming for Ethan, me, I'm, isn't it? I'm pregnant. Wanna try something different today? Role playing?
want to sell it. You need money? For which man? That male client who drove you home last week? That MD you talk to often? Or your dear Dr. Daniel? The only... It's for my dad. Put away your bags. I don't want people to think that Mr. Williams' family is going bankrupt. Finally, I can see you, Amanda. Sorry, I've been burnt in work these days. How about your checkup? Daniel, I'm pregnant. What? Okay, well, you okay? How about baby? You have so many questions. The baby is fine. The doctors say I have a stomach bleeding, but it's not very terrible. You will take care about yourself and your baby. Thank you. We, we are fine. If you need something, you just let me know. What? Ethan, if we have a baby, would you like it? Our baby? Seriously? Shouldn't it be your and Daniel's baby? Ito, what's wrong? Nothing. Did I disturb you? Are you with Daisy? Ito, I want to miss you. You should go back. I'll be fine. Don't worry. I'll stay here with you. Anything else? I don't want to hear your boring joke. Ito, let's get the divorce. Mrs. Williams, there is a divorce agreement. Please let me know if there is anything else you want to add. Thank you for coming, Mr. Fox. Looks like my wife already has an appointment. Ethan, why are you here? Why am I here? <laughs> I didn't know I needed to report to you when I come back to my own house. I just wanted to see who the bastard is that made my wife want a divorce. Is it this guy? What, poor Daniel got dumped already? Mr. Williams, this seems to be a misunderstanding. Stop it, it's not Williams. Now what is it? This is Mr. Fox, my wife, and here is a divorce agreement. And I don't want to pay any from you. All I ask is for you to sign it and let me go. Who the hell do you think you are, Amanda Roberts? You're just my dog. Now you think you want a divorce? Ethan, calm down. So what are you doing, Mr. Williams? Still here? Wanna see something hotter? Williams, please stop. Do you want to get the call? I'm sorry, Mr. Fox. Could you please leave us alone? I need to talk to him. Okay. Ethan, what are you doing? Why do you suddenly want a fucking divorce? Why not? After the divorce, you can finally be with Daisy. Our marriage is totally a mistake from the start. Yeah, you're right. You do need a divorce. Because one man cannot satisfy a whore like you. Whatever you say, I don't want to play with you anymore. <sighs> you were the one who forced me to marry you in the first place. And now you want a divorce? Let me tell you. No way! Just believe me.
Heather, where are you? I just left home. Are you okay? I had a nightmare. I'm so scared. Don't be afraid. I'll be there right away. <sighs> Pregnant. Forget it. She must be lying. Daisy, you just got back from the hospital. You need rest. It's okay, I just want everything to be beautiful. How was your talk with What? About your... We're not getting divorced. What? What's wrong? No, nothing. I just want to say you don't have to force yourself with uh, Amanda from me. I just... Uh, You know what, I just remembered I have a meeting. How about I see you next time, okay? Hello, Eric. Hello, Daisy. What's up? Is there uh, some problems in the company? Ethan has been busy lately. I'm worried about him. Really? Ethan didn't mention anything to me. Don't worry, I'll ask him to get back to you. Okay, thank you, Eric. Bye. The witch has taken it off for me again. Any news of Samuel Roberts? Yes, we have a very uh, contact with the drug seller. Do I feel missing with him? No. I'll give her a surprise. Either. Did you and Daisy have a fight? She told me to check on you. No, we didn't. Why, did she call you? Yeah, she called me a couple of days ago. What the deal with you? What was the fight about? It's only two days. She would be fine, but... I gotta go. You guys have fun. He's definitely off to find Daisy. Amanda? Amanda, wake up. Are you alright? I'll take you to the hospital right away. Me too. I'm begging you. Let me go. Just get a divorce. Still have the energy to talk about divorce? So you're not in such a dire situation, are you? Got it. Perfect timing. I'll give you a good show. <laughs>